Hey guys, Phase 2 Action Review here doing another action figure review. Today we'll be going over the Teenage Mutant Ninja Turtles Cobra Kai crossover. I have Michelangelo versus Daniel LaRusso. Um, on the front of the box, you can see both of them in there. Like their comic book styles or uh, cartoon styles. See the art. On the side, you see Daniel LaRusso with the Cobra Kai. On this back, there's a little bit of like a bio of what this line is about and then all the other sets you have Michelangelo and Daniel LaRusso, Donatello and Johnny, um, Raphael and Crease and Leonardo and Miguel. On the side you see Michelangelo on the top, oh, let me put it this way, on the top you could see that art and on the bottom pretty much the same thing so Let's get this set open and see how they are. Alrighty guys, so I got them both out the packaging and they're both very different to me because I don't think I've had figures from this brand before. But let's check out Daniel first. So looking over at Daniel, doesn't really come with any accessories but his articulation is pretty good and it's pretty smooth. I mean, the gi, the like overlay for the gi is like, like a stretchy, rubbery material so it's a little bit weird because I don't think I've had figures like that before but um yeah the articulation is pretty good so his head can go up that far down that much he does have like a waist swivel under there um, his arms can go around bend at 90 and then there's like a swivel so that's pretty good Hands have a hinge and obviously can circle around. Same thing with the other side. Legs can kick up about this far. They kind of go out when they kick up. They can. There is a upper thigh swivel. There is a knee swivel, and then there is knee articulation. Only goes back that far. And there is a toe articulation. Um, some of the joints get stuck on these figures, I noticed, um, or are very loose or tough. The feet can go down that far, up that far, and it doesn't seem like mm, there's a little bit of pivot, but that's pretty much it. And um, yeah, that's pretty much it for Daniel. I mean, the back, Miyagi Do, black belt, and then bandana. There you go. And then going over to Michelangelo, where there is a little bit more going on um, with this one. He does come with accessories. Comes with two of his nunchucks, which are pretty cool. And then the gi is like an overlay, so I'm pretty sure you could take it off if you want to. It's just like regular Michelangelo, black belt right down there. Everything's black except for the wristbands here, and then obviously on the back. And um, yeah, this one's actually really cool. It's pretty much just a regular Ninja Turtle under there. Has everything normal, just with a gi on top, and that's pretty much it. So alrighty, cool. guys. So on to articulation for the Michelangelo. Let me just take the nunchucks out of his hand. Um. You can see that his legs have a decent amount of articulation. Bang back all the way far to the point where you can kick his shell right here. So that's some pretty good articulation. Bend that back. Uh, feet do have hinges and then toe articulation. Um, his head, decent movement all the way around. Arms can go... His arms are kind of weird. Like, it's like a hinge, but it's like not very good at like turning around very well. So, that's just one of the problems. Um, there is finger articulation, which is kind of cool. You don't see much figures with that nowadays. And, um, yeah, not a lot of- well, there is actually a crunch a little bit. A little crunch. A little bit back, a little bit forward. And, uh, yeah, you could see, like I said, under there. Might be a little bit better articulation if you just took that off, but I'm not going through that right now. They don't feel like taking it off. And, uh, 
that's pretty much it for articulation. Alrighty guys, this is the end of the video. Uh, if you enjoyed the review, please hit that like button and consider hitting the subscribe button. Do tons of different action figure reviews. Um, let me know if you enjoy either Ninja Turtles, I could do some more turtle stuff, or even Cobra Kai or Karate Kid. Um, and yeah, um, this is a part of the haul, which is up on my channel, so go check that out if you haven't already. And uh, yeah, so hit that like button, consider hitting the subscribe button, and I'll see you guys in the next one.